Hey, what's up, YouTube, Facebook, brothers and sisters? My tags are dead, so I'm not wanting to get pulled over. <laughs> hey, oh, I'm a freaking, uh, hypocrite. I'm acting like I love God and my tags are expired. How does that work? Religion has taught us that if you're not perfect, you shouldn't be going to church. Boy, what a lie from the devil. We all need to be going to church and helping each other out. I mean, if your son messes up, do you say, you're a hypocrite, you're not my son no more. You act like you love me and you do this. You're a hypocrite. Do you do that? Oh, when you go to work, if someone slacks a little bit, do you say, hey, you're a hypocrite. You got no right to be here and fire him. I mean, the church, this dog, this dog, oh, they've tried to, they've done it. They've taught people that if you ain't perfect, you can't serve God. And oh my lands, that is the complete opposite of the truth. Nobody's perfect. Not one of us. All our righteousness is filthy rags, folks. And if you're what Jesus said when when the woman they brought her into him and said, She's an adulteress and and when Jesus said, He who is without sin cast the first stone. Read the story. Before that, he knelt down and was drawn in the sand. And, hey, just my opinion. But I think he was writing the guy's names out that had licked on her daddy and screwed her. Sorry to be so blunt, but it's just, again, it's the end of the world. I don't care. But I think Jesus was writing her names out. And they're like, dude, that's my name. And yeah, I did. And he's like, Whoever is without sin cast the first stone. We need to get, quit casting stones, people. I, I've been so excited. I get like stuttery and stuff. Sorry. But we need to quit judging each other. And if you come to church and get saved and mess up, come to church again, you are not a hypocrite. If you come to church and you're screwing your knees and you praise the Lord, you're a hypocrite. If you come to church and you sneak and peek and cheat people and hide about it and act like you're a Christian, you're a hypocrite. If you come to church and you mess up, go get drunk and you repent, you're not a hypocrite. If you come to church and you mess up and be mean to your wife and you feel bad, you're not a hypocrite. You see what I mean? It, serving God is not a Come get saved, folks. Come be washed in the blood. Get that blood on your doorpost, or you're going to die and live in a devil's hell. That's just the end of it. And when you come and get saved, there is that don't make you perfect. You know what that makes you? That makes you a saved sinner. That period. I mean, did they act like? Well, if I go to church, the roof's going to fall in and all this, and I'm not going to go to church and smoke dope and cigarettes and act like I'm... Now, quit it. Come get saved. Jesus don't care about all this trivial bullshit. It's, it's, you either believe or you don't. You either love your neighbor or you don't. At the end of the day, the only thing that matters is you love Jesus, you love your neighbor, and you love yourself. And that, that's the end of all rules. Man's the one made all these dang rules. God said all you got to do is love him, love yourself, and love your neighbor. Period. I'm out.